a rent control bill getting closer to passing here in Oregon, which would make it the very first one of its kind in the entire country. So while some renters might be happy, some landlords say that it will hurt the rental industry. Our Jennifer Dowling is live with more on the new bill and its critics. Yeah, this bill would cap rental increases on some units at around 10%, but landlords are saying that this will prohibit growth. It's going to net us a lot of safety in terms of housing. Renters who've been following attempts at rent control in the state feel that Senate Bill 608 has been a long time in coming. People won't have to worry about their rent being hiked unreasonable amounts. The bill would cap rent on units that are 15 years or older at 7% plus inflation, which will average a ceiling of around 10% per year and will also prohibit no cause evictions for those who've lived in a unit for at least a year. Some landlords are worried. They're not happy about the bill. Ron Garcia is the legislative director for the Rental Housing Alliance. The organization is neutral on the bill, but says it's heard concerns from landlords. The people that pay the bills, pay the mortgages, have rising taxes, have rising expenses, and want to, want to maintain their property and invest in it, uh, feel that any kind of arbitrary cap is, is prohibitive. A group who's against the bill called Multifamily Northwest issued this statement online saying this is devastating news for the rental housing industry in Oregon. Senate Bill 608 promises much in the form of tenant protections. However, its unintended consequences will negatively impact housing supply and security for Oregon renters. State Representative Rob No supports the bill. Despite objections from landlords, he feels it will likely pass. We are very excited to get this bill and uh, do some things to help renters have a little bit more assurance about what their rent increases are likely to be and also give renters some assurance that um, you know a landlord will have to have a good reason after 12 months of living in an apartment or a house uh, before they can ask them to vacate the premise. And Portland Tenants United is also weighing in. They say they support the bill's measures that protect tenants from no cause evictions along with rent increases. However, they say there are still some loopholes in which they feel that landlords will be able to continue to quote bully tenants over minor lease violations. Back to you. Jennifer Dowling live for us in Portland.